up YouTube? What's cool? What's cool? What's happening? It's time for life. And it's also time for love after luck, baby. So we are here with Christiana and John. Now this one was crazy. Every night Christiana has to fill out a list of places that she wants to job search. She's not allowed to meet anybody. No loved ones, no nothing. This is what she's supposed to do. She hasn't seen her mom in four years. If you look at the last episode, you'll see that she went and met her mom. It was very cute. The mom is so cute. And they had a good old funky time. Now, she wasn't actually supposed to do that. Christiana and John go for lunch. And as they're getting the menu, she's asking. You guys have an application at all? Yeah. John is like, it's not very comfortable that his back is facing the door. And Christiana is like, that's fine. I'll protect you. Next thing we know. Out of nowhere comes an employee from the halfway house. Okay. As they're about to get off, Christiana's like, okay, let's go. And it's like, coming. It's like, no, you're riding with us. So it's serious. They won't even let her ride with John in John's car. They're like, nope, you're coming with us. And uh, what do you call it? And she's like, oh my goodness. So they walk, and as they're walking to the car, they're arguing. I can't continue to go out and drop seat. Nope, not right now. Am I gonna get rolled up? And the halfway house dude and the parole officer as well. They're like, we've been watching you. You went there to have lunch, this and that and that. And she's like, no, I really asked for a job application. I asked for a job application. I'm like, they could have asked the waitress and she would have told them. But the thing is this, if they went to do a restaurant and the restaurant people would be like, no, sorry, we don't have jobs. Would you then still sit there and have your meal? Because these are two conflicting things. These are the things that should be separated. You're not supposed to go out for meals. You're supposed to have fun, is what it sounds like. You're just supposed to look for the job. So basically, you go in there if you're hey, if you're gonna have a banana, an apple, whatever. I don't know. I don't know. She was obviously hungry enough to have lunch. So I'm just like, this is so sad. So now she's not gonna have lunch. That's just sad. But I'm sure at the halfway house they have food. But yeah, it's just kind of like wow, very abrupt. And they did not ex expect this. They thought they were being very careful, but obviously not. And it's like, if this becomes a very serious thing, like the, basically the guy, she was like asking him questions and he was like you'll be restricted to the building so that means that she won't be able to look for a job at all anymore she will be confined to that building of the halfway house and john is like maybe they'll place her somewhere else in which case he would have to bond her out which is a whole thing as well and he's saying we we're trying to be as careful as we could but because of an extra couple of moments together she could possibly go back to prison christiana does actually say that she had this feeling that somebody was watching her like she had that feeling and i think especially if you're in this kind of precarious uh situations like you're an ex-inmate and you have to be very careful you need to be like when you have that gut feeling you need to follow it like it is not important to have all the fun in the world right now you will have it at some point but now according to john she's risking actually going back to prison like i need somebody to explain the rules to these people because everybody's jumping parole everybody's jumping halfway house restrictions we've got people out here uh you know having two strikes and three strikes this year back in prison for good or whatever these rules need to be so clear i'm sure they are clear but i don't know what these people are doing because they're not sticking to the rules at all like i said in my last video one of the last videos i've been posting every day this week these rules need to be very clear like it's not clear at all I'm, I'm so confused. It's not clear or they just want to live the high life and they're tired of being confined to certain spaces and having certain restrictions, but this is not the way. This is definitely not the way. This is crazy. I don't know what's going to happen here. This is so sad. Her mom would be devastated to know that her daughter would be going back to prison. So I hope not for her, but we'll just have to wait and see. Back with another video here tomorrow about another couple. If you're not already, make sure you hit bump some as something that subscribe button. Comment because I really want to know what you think. Would you have been extra cautious? Would you have just go job for job for job? Would you have just found 20 jobs just to excel, just to outdo even what they want you to do and really wait till you get the okay to actually start doing things like going out to eat and stuff like that? Or would you risk it all? And obviously, like this video because you like this video. Well, sure to hit the notification bell i'll see you in the next one which will be tomorrow make time for glorious life it's time to start what living right god bless